What's going on guys, it's Martin Lifestyle here and today I am going to do a different kind of video on this channel. I'm going to do an RC video because this is one of my favorite hobbies other than surfing, but surfing is kind of a sport anyways, but um, and video games so just wanted to see what kind of views this gets because on my other channels I made about RC these have been getting a lot of views so today what I will be doing is installing two back tires and two front tires so right here we got the Proline calibers and the Proline slicers which are really good if you have loose dirt and uh, yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and install these but if you guys are wondering if you guys are new to RC basically all you gotta do is take this tool that came with your truck or whatever car you got and you just wanna unscrew these little lug nuts in here just unscrew it all the way but I will um, be back and show you the final result alright so so far we just removed the rear tires and we put the new ones on and it already looks like it's ready for racing and I think it looks actually way cooler than just these but um, depends what you're doing if you're racing on dirt or the road or all terrain whatever but anyways um, yeah so those are the back and I'm gonna put on the front Alright, and there is the final product. We just put the slicers on the front, and uh, they look really nice, and actually this gives a nice touch to your truck. It almost looks like it got lifted a little bit, and um, it's really cool. And <laughs> I actually bought the Proline lift kit, as you can see with these little screws. I already lost one back here, but um, whatever. And the lift kit was a fail. I installed it wrong, and I screwed it all up. I tried modifying it, didn't work, and I was out 20, I, don't, I forgot how much it was, I think it was like 12 bucks or something, but anyways, that's off topic, but these wheels look great, and uh, <clears throat> the reason you would actually get new wheels is if the tire tread on these are getting worn down on um, your stock wheels or or you're just into something different like dirt racing, mud racing, sand racing. Sand racing is really bad I think for your truck, for your engine, but puts a lot of stress on it. That's my opinion. That's what I think. But I I just do dirt tracks and stuff. So these are good. These get dug into the dirt really nice with all those little prickly things, which is really good. And then these, I'm not positive. My friend gave me these for like 10 bucks for two of them, which was a great deal. But um, I'm not really sure if I'm right on this, but I'm pretty sure when you turn, it's supposed to make the dirt go through your tires so you have a better turn. It's better at cornering or whatever. But uh, yeah, so that's basically it. Oh, there's my old wheels and there's my new. But uh, do not throw these out, of course. I don't know why anyone would, but I'm just letting you guys know. Don't throw these out because um, do not run these on anything but dirt if you have the same setup because it will run down quick if you run it on asphalt. These are medium compound back here and these are soft. Actually, those might be medium. Those are medium too. Medium and medium. So they're, they're the best for all around. But uh, yeah, so sorry, I kind of whatever I just kept talking about random stuff there but anyways yeah so that's the first upgrade of this truck and I'm gonna be doing more RC videos in this channel now it's something I love to do and it's something other than gaming and I kind of want to get away from gaming for a little bit now but anyways thanks for watching guys please like this video if you liked it comment and uh, yeah so thanks for watching guys